This might actually be real. <laughs> Hello and welcome to my channel. My name is Kristen Wickland and here are some of the scariest alien TikTok videos I have found on TikTok. So if you like to delve into UFOs, UAPs, aliens, and things of that nature, you're at the right channel. Okay, so let's celebrate right into it, shall we? Some of these I haven't even watched yet. I figured I would save them for us, for you know, you and I. And do you believe? Because sometimes I forget some. Let's start off with good old number one here. Now let me know what you think. Does this look like this is something that... Let's just take a look. La policía de Miami, Florida. Look at everything in the background. You saw a blow dryer, an air compressor. Why are... That's on cling wrap. Okay, wait. Hold on one second. La policía de Miami, I try Florida to pay attention to... So to me... Even though I am a believer in UFOs and aliens, even though Elon Musk is not, um, he went from saying that we are not the only ones in the universe, how could we be, to saying that we are, which is really sad, and almost like, why would he do a complete role reversal? Right, right. Why is he backing up his story unless he knows something and he's protecting us? But this to me looks fake. This looks like SFX, like for a movie or something. That looks like paint splatters. Oh, 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 oh right there. What is that? Is that a paintbrush? Oh. Hmm. And his air compressor for the this, this spray gun. That's why I keep seeing all these drops everywhere on the table. They did a really good job. I don't know what movie that's for, though. Hmm. It is probably what they look like. <laughs> look at it. Someone wrote, is it cake or is it real? That's funny. They finally caught my ex-husband. Give bro a pillow, at least. Nah, the box is good. They could have done a better job covering up their background. Okay, so. Maybe not a convincing starting video, but let's go to. See, that's been the issue as of lately. Too many people are on this bandwagon of aliens and UFOs, and although I'll, I'll, I'll admit it, a lot of the UFO videos that are coming out, UAP videos that are coming out, released from government officials, um, those videos are very compelling. One second. Let's... So, let's see here. What is this one? So this is... What the heck? This gimbal footage is the first of three U.S. military videos of UAPs. Never seen this one. Official gimbal UAP footage USA. It says declassified in the comments from the creator. Here's the video I have seen. I believe we've all seen. This is like the Tic Tac video. Oh, though, this is the video I've seen too. This is, this is the one that really got me believing like, oh, oh maybe. I shouldn't say a uh, maybe. No, I shouldn't say this one really got me believing. I was a believer before that, and I have my reasons. Wow. And they're moving really fast. And what I recall from that video was they had a hard time locking onto it because it had no radar. No.
That one makes me a little queasy in that valley. <clears throat> Someone said Project Blue Jeans. <laughs> I have, I've held Project Blue Book in my hand. In uh, college, actually. I had, uh, wanted to do a report on... It was supposed to be like a... Do a report on like official government documents. And I went down... Because the college, the university that I went to... Was, um, was for the National Archives. So the library was a National Archive li library. So they had all of every government document your little heart could ever desire. Me being the alien enthusiast I was, which again, I have my very strong reasons for it. Yeah, that right there was a really good example of like government type UFO videos that I am talking about. So again, that's why when I come across videos that are like, oh, look at this alien here on the table. First of all, you know that's not real. And I don't want to be that debunker person. I want to get into some really scary UFO videos that make me ponder. But those kind of videos, don't believe them. Not at all. But we are getting into more declassified type videos. So it is going to get a little bit harder to discern. So here's one. Scary leaked alien footage from Area 51 allegedly. I have to blur that out. Hmm. Space free, space junk. See, here's the other thing too about our government. You know, if aliens are a thing, which I shouldn't say are, I don't want to be that per like I don't want to say it like that. Because they are a thing, right? They've been on the planet longer than we have. In fact, a lot of people believe they brought us here. So that being the case, humans have known about these things for eons. And we've got, they've gotten really good at covering it up. Really good. Have you ever heard of the Men in Black? You don't think they're not real? I mean... <sighs> Okay, so some stories I have about aliens, I really ponder if I should even share them, if it's, like, worth it or not. But, like, I did have a friend back in California. I don't talk to them anymore. I don't, you know what I mean? It's one of those things. But they did tell me a story one time about their cousin who lived in Mexico who had this tiny little creature basically die in their yard and they said it was like a little person and uh well like long story short people two pe two people showed up to this guy's door and without like really saying much they basically knew i mean i don't see that's the thing when people say that when they're in encounters with the men in black they always say that they feel like they've used telepathy on them because it's like they don't really talk and that's what happened with this guy's cousin and they ended up confiscating this thing from him um that being said there are there's one one video i saw men in black are real for decades people have reported encountering these strange men after they witness a ufo in many cases they show up at witnesses houses in vintage black cars to ask yeah, bizarre that's and intimidating questions but this guy said there's also something strange that his about cousin them, as they appear to void facial features or are often sickly pale that his cousin and said robotic with their movements it's said that these are either government agents or aliens trying to cover up you why does that give me the chills that is why many believe that's, the that's why i don't want to talk too much that's why i don't want to talk about my encounter is so much um or my ex my hmm how do i phrase this my anything to do with extraterrestrial because you know what i mean and a lot of times they'll be like oh we can chalk this all up to a government something or another but that we couldn't talk about um what is that hey what is that do you see that guys what is it? Oh, 
It's almost like he was about to start laughing at the little wait, girl screaming. He's like, oh, 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 wait, serious again. On? Are you kidding me? What is that? Someone call somebody. Just making sure I'm recording. That one was like, nan, when, when. Should I mute this? So we what don't is that? <laughs> oh my god, bro. 5,000 times. What is that, eh? Southern Illinois? Aliens? Oh, I'm not even on. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> 2023. So sorry, the We've commentary. We've made con the, the commentary is so funny, though. It's just sitting there now. Now it's just sitting there. Sat in there. Even the baby's confused. This is one of those videos I have not viewed. It's an alien. What is that? Oh, what? That was right over the house, guys. This is so crazy. Oh my goodness. It's still up there. That's pretty far up there. Oh my god. What is that? So. Let's go to the comments, because you know how juicy the comments use the, you, And someone wrote, Ellie ends. That's how that one kid was. <laughs> I just love the comments so much. Oh, yeah. Someone wrote, what is that? Whoa, what is that? Yeah, he literally said, what is that? What is that? Like a million times. Bro, there are Starlink satellites. Uh, somebody call somebody Project Blue Balls. Oh, <laughs> That's a drone flight's hanging from it. I mean, that's literally what it looked like. It looked like a drone. Hmm. I need something more convincing than that. That was good, though. Alien caught on camera. Alien caught on camera. Well. First of all, it looks like Dobby from Harry Potter. Um, <laughs> Harry Potter. Second of all, hooves. That leg's a little wonky. Um, I mean, no shade, bro. No shade, but he got glowing eyes. Hmm. <laughs> See what the comments say, just real quick. It's Dobby. See, someone agrees. It's Dobby. That's my sister. She s sleepwalks a lot. <gasps> no, that's just my bro Dobby and his morning walk. Yeah, I've never seen this one. I'm gonna say CGI. So, there's that alien creature again popping up in another video. Now it's the backside, real or fake. I mean, fake. You can see the paint splatters all over the ground. It must be where it breathes. They did a good job. Wow, it's really convincing. Like the face and some parts of it are good, but then you can tell it's silicone. You could tell if you touched it, it would just feel like a a dildo. I hate to say it that way, but okay, here we go. The U.S. government is finally exposed. So for you who don't know, three witnesses had a hearing in Congress about aliens, and they exposed as much as they could. This man saw images of what real aliens look like, and this is what he said. Okay, that the first was video. Of something that I am not able to attach to any human capability, either from the United States or from any of our adversaries. And they saw a sequence of four craft in a clear diamond formation one of the pilots goes to check out that diamond formation and sees a large floating what i can only describe as an orb again like i said not of any human capability that i'm that i'm aware of now during this hearing they exposed the government's program where they tried to reverse engineer <laughs> crashed ufos and during the reverse engineering process apparently bad things have happened to people they've also collected everything they could get their hands on including alien bodies and a lot of questions asked to the witnesses they so a lot of these publicly. i mean this that's is all from news and the really strange news at alien the same 51 time. we might get museum. another hearing if congress that, approves but until then hopefully the that witnesses i have are an safe. explanation for right the US now government is finally exposed so, 
this is what this video this channel is gonna be about I want to find the best and the most authentic realist we're gonna sort out the bullshit the BS from the good now these government videos that we are watching this is all legit that stuff was real them the testifying I watched that on television they the government officials really did do that um, which I love this cover the comment right here that says government aliens are real people okay because <laughs> literally we don't need you to tell us they're real we know you've been covering it up and then what happens with them is they go it's real and then they'll turn around and go no 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 we we didn't say that they're not real that's not what we meant and then they'll do whatever they can to like cover it up and like Elon Musk will come out and say no we're here we're alone let's head to Mars and that's how the only way you're gonna get people to Mars is by tell them telling them we are alone not only that but we kind of need to go to Mars anyways the earth is only gonna be here for a billion more years we need to colonate somewhere else so the future population of us has somewhere to go and then future space travel anyways I digress and maybe I sound a little whatever but so this first video that they played with this thing right here we're gonna debunk that right now cuz here's the video of it just pay attention to the background pay attention to the alien too but see where his hand is at bro's hand just disappears you don't even see it anymore but look at the background brushes silicones so clearly that's fake that's a puppet that's where his hand is at his hand is in the head this is for a movie or whatever the case is so again that one's debunked that's not real this video right here has nothing to do with aliens not this video but that's coming up let's hear the... this video right here has nothing to do with aliens but this is a phenomenon i don't know what it means i have seen this before i just was not able to get it on camera where it literally looks like the plane is just hovering I have seen that before. It's really freaky. I've only seen it one time and that's it. Hasta hay tráfico. Porque todos quieren tomar fotos. La policía. La policía? Huh. What's that oh shit so yeah this video starts off bad but that ended like fairly with some what the heck some stuff you're like is that a drone or is that a drone or is that huh Okay, this is just funny to me, this video right here. We're just going to throw this in here just for a little funny. We're going to throw this in. I won't be able to play much. In fact, I'm going to have to mute most of it. It says, why won't aliens visit Earth? And then it says the average human disagreement. War. It just ends in war. It says, bro making a bloodbath over $1.50. <laughs> that's basically... Yeah, that's basically about it. So this is okay i didn't watch this video this one i was sharing saving for us remember these little guys from last week well these so-called alien corpses have now undergone lab testing i didn't yep, i didn't see right. this they've had a full ct scan and x-rays the bodies Which were i know this is old but last week by a self-proclaimed ufo expert named jaime Mauson. he claimed they had been discovered in peru in 2017 and were 1800 years old his presentation went viral with many calling the bodies aliens. The so-called corpses have been tested by Jose de Jesus Salce Benitez. This is the size. Who says the specimens each belong to a single skeleton and have not oh been manipulated. But the findings have been widely disputed by scientists. This Last is the week, size of the creature that this guy said his cousin said 
that he found. And I also wonder if this isn't the creatures the guy found. Remember these little guys from last week? Well, these so-called alien corpses. Now so is there anything testing. more yep, on those then? Okay, it says replying to at BBC News, a previous discovery by the two men was debunked and shown to be two human mummies manipulated to appear alien. Hmm. That's a shame. That's why it's always like, you know what I mean? Like, no one can really be like, is that, is that for real? Six minutes long? This is six minutes long? The, um, hmm. Hmm. What do you think? What are you thinking? What do you think? What are you thinking? Is this real? Is this like... <laughs> I need... I need feedback on this. Is this CGI? Is this... Because it seems CGI, right? And the interview interviewer, it seems... Like bad acting? Like that. I don't believe that for a second. We're more than just random. Yeah. Bad acting, bad acting. Why is it bad acting? And then. What is this? 1964 Project Blue Alien Grape video part one. This looks just like the alien from the last video. X recorder? What is it? Hold on. Is this an app? Is this why the app, the alien looks the same? <laughs> Before we go any further. X recorder. X recorder, screen recorder, and GIF maker. Screen recorder? X recorder? Really? Named X recorder. And they all seem to be be a screen recorder of some some fashion so that makes me wonder here so i don't know i don't know okay let's just finish another tell us the truth or an audible It's just like the last video. Same concept.
This one's better than the last one, though. But it's the same. <laughs> this one's better. That one's a little more so s okay. This one's a little more convincing, isn't it? Just like oh. Okay, I know we just watched it, but this might actually be real. <laughs> Part one. Oh, oh, sh sh where's part two, my brother? Where's part? Where's part two? Hold on. Hmm. This is how you get a good feeling about who these people are. He doesn't have anything else on here that's even remotely conspiracy theory or. No, he just reposted that video from somebody. Hmm. Also, we have this. That may prove extraterrestrial life exists. The fuzzy video, reportedly filmed in a remote Peruvian jungle in 2018, shows a slender, six foot tall, humanoid with pale skin, eerily walking between trees. The creature's oversized head, long neck, and spindly limbs resemble descriptions of the alien greys found in supposed eyewitness accounts. And we also have this. This is supposedly one of the aliens that's at a gas station in Peru, and a truck actually runs through it, and nothing happens. You know, this is crazy. What? What are these things? Are Wait. and a truck actually runs through. But we don't see that. What? 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 Show them. Nothing happened. He didn't show the video. You know, this is crazy. What are these things? Are they aliens, or what else could they be? And this is some more footage of a pretty clear footage of one of the aliens, right? You know, recently, uh, within the last 24 hours, that was taken. I was told a uh, piece of a video that I found, and it <laughs> looks pretty clear. This was taken by uh, <laughs> a guys. resident of one of, of this village, and you know I just Holy don't think shit. it's fake. What I is think that? this is very real. It looks, it seems to be, it appears to be very real. And look at it; it kind of reminds heck? me of what we heard about in Vegas. When you look at this. The description reminds me of the Vegas aliens, although we never could get a clear picture. 
This goes to more of what David Gross was talking about when he said they were interdimensional, when they were actually from here. And you know, people, to be honest, are dead yes, and they're a lot more hmm. populated than a little village. Wow. What do you think about that? I mean, the first, the, the that first video of the... Okay, so I do this, this video exists. right here. The fuzzy video, reportedly filmed in a remote Peruvian jungle in 2018, shows a slender... So I was trying to find the... Is this it? Yeah, here we go. That may prove extraterrestrial life exists. I want to see this without that guy's video. commentary. Reportedly filmed in a remote Peruvian jungle in 2018, shows a slender, six foot tall humanoid with pale skin, eerily walking between trees. The creature's oversized head, long neck, and spindly limbs resemble descriptions of the alien greys found in supposed eyewitness accounts. The man who filmed the being did so discreetly while hiding behind foliage too frightened to approach it the video's poor quality adds an air of mystery mm -hmm. making it impossible to conclusively identify the strange entity yet it's clearly inhuman characteristics provoke fascination well is this finally evidence we are not alone in the universe dang oh my god i incredible new footage has surfaced that may prove real life exists the fuzzy video that this that there's like a clip right in there where it's like how that can't be a human right there dressed like a like an alien look at the head shape i mean it could be cgi definitely or this one is a little mm, i don't know if i wouldn't say it is compelling but i kind of you have interesting the only video that proves that aliens exist. Okay, that guy I don't and like. You're sitting on it and you're not showing it to anybody. James Fox shares a previously unheard story about you going to purchase this existing footage of aliens landing on the earth for a rack of hundreds. So you said, hey man, do you mind just showing it to me? And while he showed it to you, you recorded it on a secret camera. I'll spill the beans. The footage is compelling, not convincing. Everything about it screams bull which is the true reason I haven't released it. It doesn't have enough meat on the bone and proof for me to put it out confidently and be like, this is legit UFO footage. The disc hovers so fluidly, it's like buoyant almost in the air. And it's the one compelling mm. thing about this video where I'm like, maybe that's something. You have hmm. the- Hmm, he might, he might have been given something that uh kind of proves i mean it could be i would like to see the video that much i know i'd like to see the video they are literally everywhere 4300 plus videos a day the heck so that wouldn't be a drone if it was whoever is flying that drone is going to prison everywhere. 4, plus videos a day. like it wouldn't even be worth to put a drone up that high what what crystal clear ufo i mean for real? What the frick frack? Just because you can't identify doesn't mean it's full of little green men. No, that's that's the problem. It doesn't mean it's full of little green men. It probably it is gotta be a spy drone of some sort, right? Who? Who? And if it's not Russia, if it's not China, if it's not, you know what I mean? Our enemy will say. We need to know who this is. We need to know who is who is flying these for our safety, for our airspace, because some of them fly past airplanes really fast. Wow. That wouldn't be cool to see that when you're in a plane. I'd be like, okay, so we're not safe. Here's another one. See how look how fast that's flying past the airplane. 
It's got writing on it. Does that, what does that say? Truff? Truff? So that's not, that's F F U R. I mean, stuff. Oh, God. Again, if you're going to fly a drone up that high, you better be ready to go to jail. Truff. Wow. The Truff UFO video explained. There's a new video. Wait. The Truff U. Wait, is this a different one or a new one? I can't. I don't think I can show this because I don't. Well. So, it almost, to me, at first, I thought this was going to say Trump. I, I would have to assume that this has got to be fake. CGI, right? Well, everybody, I really hope you all enjoyed that very, very much. These are fun. Um, I am a, I am not a skeptic in any way, shape, or form, although I like to debunk videos because there's too many people out there who truly do believe these videos are real. I just want to be here to be the one to be like, no, 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 listen. And I don't know everything, obviously, but some of these are extremely obviously fake. Extremely obviously fake. Like uh, this one. This one is couldn't be any further. Fr they're first of all, they did an okay, somewhat okay job, but they're shading in some spots around the eyes, around the mouth, like the red areas where their shading is at, and like the weird champagne tone that goes across the stomach and all of that that's where you kind of lose me and then you start to see you see all the paint splatters everywhere of course it's fake and the air compressor in the back the paint brushes all of that but a lot of people don't see that stuff like the hair like what do you need to blow dry for you know what I mean except for if you're trying to dry paint so you can videotape it but again let me know if you have any creepy UFO scary ghost videos anything paranormal anything eccentric that we want to watch on this channel please send it my way i have an email herweekendtravels at gmail.com i have a tiktok it is also under her weekend travels please hit me up let's have some fun together and i will see you all later bye <laughs> Could you love her? A oh, haunted, haunted house. Oh, could you love me now? A oh, haunted, haunted house. Can love a pretty little mansion